Are you up for an adventure? I know I am. Willing to try something you've never had before? Go on a blind date. With a book! This February. <laughs> the, the entire month, there will be books covered, some with topics, genres, and minimal information on the outside, available for checkout. For every blind date you check out, you'll be entered to win a free drink at the media center. Fall in love with a good book. Blind date with a book drawing at number one. And the winners today are, drum roll, please. Number one, Kelly Weichman from Mrs. Schubert's Homeroom, 209. Number two, Olivia Sch Schlinkman, Mr. Freimoyer's Homeroom, 225. And number three, Carrie Daigle, Mr. Hershey Student Teacher, Homeroom, 309. Stop by the Media Center to collect your prizes. All lost and found items on the table located in the high school lobby will be donated on February 16th. Please stop by the table and claim any items before they are gone. Attention juniors, Millersville University will be hosting a college fair on Thursday, March 15th. This fair attracts approximately 150 different colleges, universities, and trade school representatives. This is a great opportunity for 11th graders to interact with and learn about different colleges. The itinerary includes attending the college fair, having lunch, in the Millersville Dining Hall and taking a campus tour. If you are interested in attending, please print out a field trip permission packet from school. Space is limited, so do not delay. Now, over to our best man, Seth Fulham. <clears throat> oh, Ethan, that's so sad. You are cool. <laughs> oh, thank you. Okay. Well, in the news, the government went into partial shutdown last night as the Senate failed to pass a budget resolution before the midnight deadline. Ooh. The holdup was primarily the concern of Rand Paul, junior senator from Kentucky, who believed that the new spending bill would increase deficits dramatically. The bill ended up passing the Senate with a vote of 78 to 21. The only block between the government and two years of appropriated federal spending is the U.S. House of Representatives. The bill will be slightly more difficult to pass in the House, but senior analysts expect it to pass regardless. On this day in 1960, the first star is added to the Hollywood Walk of Fame. Actress Joanne Woodward earned the honor of having the first ever ceremony where her name was added. Today, there's more than 2,500 stars on the walk, including Kermit the Frog and Shrek. Shrek is all Shrek's life. <laughs> also, in 1964, the Beatles performed in America for the first time on a popular evening television show called The Ed Sullivan Show. They were already popular, but this skyrocketed their career forward. About 75 million people were watching that night, and some girls definitely fainted in the audience. And if we know, if Mary was alive then, she would have fainted as well. What a band. By the way, did you see that we hung up hearts? They're kind of cute, aren't they? <laughs> All right, now over to the dynamic duo Ethan and Edwin with lunch. Good night. Good night. What was that? That's probably <laughs> not sanitary. <laughs> <laughs> I got those. Oh, quick problem. Where did it go over to? It's like the top of your head. Uh, <laughs> didn't even hear it. Probably. I, I didn't get up in time. I was going to go yeah, over like there. Yeah, I feel like <laughs> Like that. My guy in the background does not <laughs> <laughs> He was trying to look what he does at the end. He puts, did, you, did you tell him? Yeah. No, no. Just, <laughs> 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 I kept it in until you I'll tell you when to read. Then you can switch on. <laughs> <laughs> no. Yes. I'm okay, going so to read. Like, yeah, Alright, so we're going to do that thing where we like. But, but you don't. Yeah. Okay. Turnover chain! Turnover chain! Now, <laughs> 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 open with that. Hamel chain. Sports resorts. <laughs> oh, thank you. Just gonna... <laughs> sports resorts. Bowling beat uh, Cedar Crest 7 0, and wrestling lost to Warwick. Rival action after the loss in Manhattan Township, 496 to 497. Ah! Top shooters were Nicole Johnson, 102 centers. Joel, Joel Potts, 99 three center. Madison Miller, 99 and one center. Brianna Bowers, 99 and one center. And Kyle Good, 99. Tonight at eight, the opening ceremony will take place at the Winter Olympics in Pyeongchang. Pyeongchang. There have already been several medals awarded. The U.S. is in the lead. Overall, um, overall.
overall medals at 28 with Norway and Canada at second and third. Today in sports, the bowling, the boys swimming team will